what I was going to say was that even I've been on YouTube learning what I could about the allegations um, and, and a lot of stuff would come up from the past, like in uh, in the early 90s, the Merv Griffin show and the um, um, Geraldo Rivera show and uh, Tom Cole, the ring boy that, that was accusing Mel Phillips, the ring announcer, what he was doing and, and all of that stuff. But anyway, back then, they thought it was okay to to express their tongue in cheek humor about the situation by letting out little jokes during commentary, you know, like there'd be a rest of those programs, like the, 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 uh, Phil Donahue or, the, or, uh, yeah. The, well, you, you were watching them. wrestling, you heard them and you didn't oh, understand. I get what you mean. Yeah. Yeah. Like, you know, they, there'd be a wrestler in the ring and they'd say, Oh, he comes, you know, right out of the back door of Terry, Terry Garvin's school of wrestling or, or whatever. I don't know if that's exactly. Um, yeah. Yeah, and and it was, and you look back at it now, and uh, not that it was okay then, but if it was at all funny then, it certainly fucking isn't now at all. And, and it's like, it's like that was how long ago? Thirty years ago plus. Yeah. And already it was old news. It was already old news, you know. Um, so it, it's crazy to think uh, looking back. At, at that um, the horribleness, how bad it was then, and to think that people could, for thirty years, continue on that um, on that on that pathway, and it, I don't think the world feels the same about it. Not that they they were outraged then, but not. I don't think you know. In today's world, it's very much more unacceptable than it was in 1900, maybe even in 1970, even though it was really, really bad. And right. um, in the wrestling business, we were almost like a secret society. We were really close knit and uh, nobody knew what we were doing and maybe they thought that was all right or, uh, but you know, now with social media and the worldwide news, you can hear something that happened in China from 20 minutes, you know? Uh, instantly, mm -hmm. uh, so but it, it's been going on for a long time, and you know, the wrestling business has kept uh for a long time and you know held that secret. Now, where's uh sports entertainment? I don't call it wrestling anymore, ever. Uh, yeah, what, what do you do if I'm at a party with my wife, she's a nurse, and the doctors say, Oh, fun, fun, what do you do for a living? I say, Oh, I was a sports entertainment. You know you dropped my name, Daddy. 